friends, welcome back to my channel. Today is going to be a really fun video. I am going to be shopping for fall decor. It is September, right now it's Labor Day weekend, and it's time for fall in my mind. So we're going to go out, we're going to go to a couple different stores today. We're going to find some fall decor for our apartment, and I'm really excited. So I do own a little bit of fall decor already. So I don't want to buy too much, so I'm going to set a budget for myself of like $60. We'll see how that goes. <laughs> My cat is moving the camera. We are going to go to Target, Home Goods, Marshalls, TJ Maxx. I think those are all the stores. And we'll see what we can find. Um, and then we'll come back and I'll show you what I buy. So I want you to come with me. And I'm really excited. If you have never been to my channel before, hello, my name is Corey, and I do teaching and lifestyle videos. I'm really happy you're here, so go ahead and subscribe and like, and now we're going to get out of here and go shopping. Okay, so I found both these garlands, and I don't know if I want either. I think I like this one more. There are so many cute pillows here, and I found one I really like. Yay! Smell candles and a mask on. A win on the first one. Also, I'm totally gonna be over budget. I have made it home and Pep is so excited about everything. Oh, so let's see what I got. Okay, so I am back from doing my fall decor shopping. So we're gonna quickly go through what I bought and um, I will try to remember how much everything was. So here we go. So the very first thing I got was this really tiny little jar with a pumpkin on it. I think it's probably used for sugar, um, but I might just use it as decor because I really like our little sugar jar. So. This is from Marshalls, and it was $4.99 as I take off the sticker. Okay, that's the only thing I found at Marshalls that I really wanted. So the next thing, or the next place I went was Kirkland's, and I didn't really find anything at Kirkland's that I personally wanted to buy. There was tons of fall stuff there. It just was a little pricey for me, and also it definitely gave me the vibe of decorating a house, which I live in an apartment, so... I had to buy things that were small and little, and those things were definitely bigger for a house. Um, so if you have a house, go to Kirkland's because they have a lot of fall stuff there. So I didn't find anything at Kirkland's, and then I went to TJ Maxx slash Home Goods. It was in one store. Sometimes they're together, sometimes they're not. This one was, and I only found one thing that I wanted, which I showed in the store, and it is this really cute fall leaf pillow it's very soft and this was I believe $19.99 um, sorry it's unzipped so this was $19.99 and I think I said at the beginning of this video that my budget was $60 so I'll have to add this up at the end but right now I don't know so this is $20 it's super cute it's pretty big um, and yeah it also has this, like, you can tell that the crochet on the outside is definitely, like, 3D. And then it's just, like, that dark orange color. My cat is here. He wants to be a part of this, too. And then the last place I went to was, obviously, where I knew I was going to find the most stuff, which was Target. So 
I ended up buying four things from Target. So the first thing I got was this cute little ceramic truck. It was from the Target Dollar Spot. It was $3. And I just think it's really cute. I'm going to put it somewhere out on a shelf. And I also think because there's no pumpkin sitting in it, I could probably leave it out all year. Love that for me. But this is super cute. I really liked it. They also had blue ones, like navy ones, but I liked the green better. Okay, the next thing I got was this fuzzy pumpkin. It was in the like Halloween section of Target, you know, like the seasonal section in the back, but it definitely is bright orange, like Halloween, but it's very cute. It says indoor decorative use only. So it's an indoor decorative pumpkin, but it actually is like very hard, but it definitely feels like knit on the outside. There's a knit material. So I really like it and it has the twine running through the middle of the pumpkin and these little X's all over and some of them are even pink, which I think is super cute. So this pumpkin was $10 and it's very durable, so I'm excited about it. Next, I got a fall candle, which I feel like is a given when you go decor shopping. You have to buy a candle. So we had the leaves candle from Bath and Body Works burning um, and we're almost done with it. And <laughs> we've only had it for a couple of weeks. So I had to get a new one. And I got this beautiful candle from Opal House, the Target brand Opal House. It is pink. It's like a dark pink, dark orange, but it also has like a rainbow like play with the lights. So this is in the scent, crushed apple spice, and it smells amazing. So I'm gonna smell it. It's just a one wick candle, it's white on the inside, and I don't know how to describe this scent. It kind of smells, it kind of smells like the leaves candle, which is probably why I liked it. Um, yeah, it's just like a, a subtle fall scent. It's definitely not in your face. It doesn't smell like pumpkin. Um, I guess it smells like spice more than anything. So, yep, yeah, got this candle. I believe it was $12.99. I don't know. I'm going to have everything linked below if I can find it. If it was from Target, I definitely can find it. But, you know, TJ Maxx and Marshalls are hard to find links for. So, all the Target stuff I will definitely link, so... This is a good one. All right, the last thing I got was a garland, and I'm a little iffy about buying a garland because I have two cats, and they like to reach up and play with everything we own. And so I got a garland because I have an idea of where I'm gonna put it, and you'll see that when I decorate. But um, it's just this like really cute pom-pom garland from Opal House. And let's open it to see what it looks like because I am curious not opening this gracefully whatsoever. All right, I'm sure it just has the three colors that are shown on the outside, but part of me wants to make sure that there's not other colors that I didn't know. Okay, ooh, there was another color. Ooh, there's more than another, one other color. My cat is right on the floor and he is very excited about this. Okay. So it has a lot of different colors. Oh my goodness, I love it so much. So it's just these like wooden beads with colorful pom-poms. So we have an orange, a greenish gray, a light pink, a dark dusty red color, and a white. Yay! So that is everything I bought today. Um, well, actually I bought one more thing that isn't fall decor related, but I want to show you anyway, and it's a chair that I'm sitting on right now. I'm sitting in the corner of our room, and there's zero background right now, but I want to make a really cute background here, and also just to have like a cute place to sit, and so I bought a chair finally. I'll put in a picture, I'll take a picture of it, but it's just this green velvet chair. It's small. 
Um, it's from Opal House. I will also link it below, but here's a picture of it. I really love it. So anyway, that is everything I bought, but I am going to go decorate and I don't know if I'm going to put it in this video or not. I guess I will just because why not? I have already started buying fall decor like through the last couple of weeks. And so I wanted to show you those things, those things too, because I'm going to put, I took them down, but I'm going to put them back where I had them when I do the little decorate with me part. So this and uh, one more thing is from last year and I have no idea where it's from, but it's just this like knit white pumpkin. It's a little uneven, probably from being stored and moved to a new state, but um, just a little white pumpkin and yeah, that's something that will be out. The next thing is this little sign and I feel like we were gifted this because I also don't know where it's from. There's no brand on the back. Anyway, it's this sign that says, hello fall with these cute little floral, like arrangement of the fall leaf in it. And it's like a shadow box thing. So that is part of our fall decor. All right, and then a couple weeks ago, I bought a dish towel set from TJ Maxx, I believe. So I bet that these are still in stores. And obviously all of these stores still have their fall stuff out. If you saw my apartment tour, we have a cat avocado dish towel set. And I kind of felt like this was the fall version. So I got that. So these are the two towels. They're so cute. So the first one is just white with three little pictures of cats as pumpkins. And it says cat o lanterns. And then the other one is just all of the cats all over. So this I definitely got at TJ Maxx maybe like two weeks ago. So you can definitely still find it. It's super cute and it is our fall dish set. Okay, the last thing I already had. I bought this at Target three weeks ago. I'll try to link it if I can find it. I don't remember the brand because the tag is now off and there's nothing on it, but it is just this wire pumpkin. I don't even know if you can tell. Also, my cats have decided that this is a good chew toy, but they have just chewed the top of it. So it's just metal and it's a little pumpkin and it's been sitting in our kitchen, so that's where it'll return when we decorate. So let's get decorating. May you always find your way to higher ground. May you always keep your head held up high. Pretty little thing You're a diamond in the rough Shining from within I can tell that you're tough Just the sight of you when I'm at my weakest point Makes a world of difference, oh you make me strong Pretty little thing You're a diamond in the rough Shining from within I can tell that you're tough Order in a cup of love Feel it rising up and above You will always keep my heart and soul strong Plant your seeds and watch them grow The light will always know where to go You will always keep my heart and soul Okay friends, so that is everything for this video. Thank you for shopping and decorating for fall with me and I will see you guys in the next one. Make sure to subscribe and like and follow my Instagram because I have an Instagram all about being a teacher. So yes, I hope you're having a wonderful day and I will see you guys in my next video. Remember, keep spreading positivity. Bye friends!